Okay, so we are at the uh, fitness center right now, and I'm going on this little bike thing, and he's, I don't know what he's doing, but. <laughs> yeah, sure. What, is it going? Yeah, it's going. Oh, all right. Uh, should I start it, or should I just like pretend I'm doing it? See, look. Eh, I don't really need to start it. I'm just kind of doing it for fun. <laughs> hey, Jay, go. Go, AJ, go. I can't see if I have you both in the thing. Do I? You do. You're good. Okay. Are you still in? Yeah. Because I don't see nothing on my side. AJ's in too? Yep. All right. <laughs> I can practice running here too for my mile. Well, that's nice August. walking. I can run on it too. <clears throat> you don't just have to walk. I'm getting your feet. Hey, JJ. My man. <laughs> what that can my heart rate, that's my heart rate, my speed, my time. Uh, what else? <laughs> this is gonna be a long video. Yeah. It's probably eight for me. Are you guys still in? Yep. We're good. You can have it. Huh? <laughs> How long is this video so far? Two minutes and 38 seconds. Oh my god. All right, everybody, we have more to go to, so. Okay. Okay, so we are at the uh, fitness center right now, and I'm going on this little bike thing, and he's, I don't know what he's doing. But. Yeah, sure. Well, is it going? Yeah, it's going. Oh, all right. Should I start it or should I just like pretend I'm doing it? Eh, I don't really need to start it. I'm just kind of doing it for fun. Hey, Jay, go. Go, AJ, go. I can't see if I have you both in the thing. Do I? You do. You're good. Okay. Whatever. Are you still in? Yeah. Because I don't see nothing on my side. AJ's in too? Yep. All right. Oh, it Practice running here too for my mile. Well, that's nice walking. I can run on it too. <clears throat> you don't just have to walk. I'm getting your feet. Hey, JJ. My oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a long video. Yeah. It's probably eight for me. Pants. 
Are you guys still in? Yep. Huh? <laughs> How long is this video so far? Two minutes and 38 seconds. Oh my god. All right, everybody, we have more to go to, so. Okay. Okay. Hey guys, so uh, we're back here at the fitness center. AJ's on the treadmill, as you can see. I just had a full workout, so I am extremely tired and I'm not really gonna do anything. I'm just gonna kind of chill here. Maybe lift some weights, so come lift some weights with me, I guess. I'm taking over because he's too busy with his thing. Alrighty. <laughs> Uh, it's not that good, but whatever. Uh, oh my god, I'm almost to the end. Alright, I'm gonna go get some uh, weights. Ooh, this is a 10 pound weight. Ow. See, I'm like this. I'm... Good arm workout. Wait, uh, uh, Valerie, have an idea after. <coughs> what? I'll tell you how to have some idea. Uh, Which would be for the vlog. Let me just let you say that. Oh, this is oh. music playing? Oh. <laughs> Ew, bro. That was all Valerie. Shut up. No, it's not. Everyone knows that was you. I'm working high, Johnny. Hi, everybody. This was a good. So, Sal just. Holy shit. Valor, can you make me What? Can you get me a what? The towels over there? Yeah. It's time to go get him a towel. I'm like rocking and that ball over here. Over here. So. You're sweating your balls off? Is that, what you said? Is that what you said? No, I said like Rocky Balboa. Oh, I thought you said I'm sweating my balls off. <laughs> what a dirty mind Valerie has. Jeez, I'm sorry. Alrighty, so I'm getting on the bicycle again. Even though I just had a like pretty good workout, but I'm gonna go get some more. Don't tell my dad. He's saying that I should take a break. But you know what? I'm not doing that. <laughs> Oh, look at him, look at him. What the hell? If you right. want to meet Daddy tonight. Oh yeah, you and Daddy will have to have your match, right? Yep. Oh yeah, what time is that? Uh, whatever you decide. And that's what... Alright. That's what my well, idea you know, is. You know our parents could be out gambling till 11 o'clock. Yeah, that's what. <laughs> and I am losing Ooh. some calories here. One calorie and time. Hold on. Valerie burned like 99 calories right now. I'm just going to chill. We're going to cut this out for a little bit. Good okay. evening and welcome to the Sal Searcher Show. Tonight we have a very special guest. Yes, that is a very special guest. The one and only beautiful Valerie Searcher. She's right here with us in Memphis, Tennessee. And tonight is a special edition. Let's welcome Miss Valerie Searcher. <laughs> We're very excited to have you on the show. We've been having people calling in and emailing, talking about when is Valerie Searcher coming on the show, and here you finally are. Tonight we have a special edition. We're going to be talking to Valerie about uh, Elvis Presley. It's a documentary right in the, here in our hometown of Memphis. So, Valerie, are you a, a, a fan of Elvis Presley? Yeah, I listen to his songs. I I think like he's a really good singer, and you know? Mm-hmm. And when did you become a fan? How long? I don't know, maybe a few years ago, like maybe in the early 2000s or like the 2010s, you know? Okay. And is that the reason why you're in Memphis tonight, to come and visit the King of uh, Rock and Roll yes. Graceland? Yes, definitely. Very nice, very nice. Um, let me ask you something. Did you, while you were here in Memphis, did you visit Beale Street? Yes, I actually went today with my family and family friends. Oh, and what did you, what did you think of it? I thought it was pretty awesome. There's a lot of people and there was a lot of things to do. Hmm. Did you stop anywhere to eat? Or yeah, we went to, uh, I don't remember, King Jerry's restaurant or whatever. Okay. 
And was there any action going on in the streets, like, you know, craziness? And yeah, there was, uh, there was a lot of craziness, actually. There was a lot of people just, mm -hmm. like, watching. And there was, this, there was these people who were... <clears throat> excuse me. There were these people who, um, you like, people paid to, like, stand in a line. And then there was, like, a person, like, running to jump, do backflips over. It was pretty cool, and I was actually kind of nervous to watch. Well, I like, heard about that. I know it's, didn't it's, want anything bad to happen. That's very active on YouTube, <laughs> that, uh, those guys. I heard about that. They, like, they, they did all kind of... Uh, uh, gymnastics and acrobatic stuff. They jump yeah. over like 10 people at a time. It's very interesting to watch. Very uh, very crazy. I mean, they do it on <laughs> regular concrete of the street. Very dangerous, but they seem to be very confident and know what they're doing. Yeah, and they've probably done it for a very long time. So uh, what would you say, uh, getting back to Elvis Presley, what would you say is your favorite Elvis song? I don't know. I like, uh, I like Hound Dog, mm. Heartbreak Hotel. Yeah, tonight we have another guest on the show. Uh, his name is AJ. Oh, really? He's an Elvis Presley impersonator. He'll be coming on shortly after we finish your interview. Oh. Yes, and I'm sure you will enjoy watching that in the background. Okay. Uh, what else did I want to ask you? Uh, will you be visiting Graceland? Oh, yeah. We're going tomorrow to oh. Elvis's house. Whoa, very nice, very nice. Yeah, and, uh, I'm very excited. I want to see what it's like. Right, right, right. Oh, who are you going with? Oh, I'm actually going with AJ and his family, and I'm going with my family. The Elvis impersonator? Wow. So you got Yeah, so my, my friend is coming on right after me. Oh. So that's why you guys are all in town at the same time. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Okay, well, we're going to break for commercial. Uh, we have a, a commercial about uh, Kraft cream cheese, and we'll be shortly after this. Let's have a big hand for Valerie Sergio. Uh She was a wonderful guest, and uh, we're definitely going to have her back on the show soon. But now we have the Elvis impersonator, the one and only AJ. Let's have a hand. For <laughs> uh, I heard that Valerie was just saying on, uh, on her interview that uh, you guys are very good friends. Yeah, we are. So basically, tomorrow we're going to Graceland. So. Mm. Pretty much, so it's my family and her family going to go to the Graceland. Very so. nice, very nice. And is this your first time going there? Yes. Hmm. And uh, how long have you been an Elvis Presley fan? Ugh. Uh, probably like months. Months? Just yeah, months? Months. Well, you're very uh, new at this then. Yeah. So uh, when you uh, go out and do your shows, you do Elvis impersonations and stuff like that, do you wear the costume and the glasses and the wig and all that stuff? Yes, I would. And I would do it on the show today, but, like... Yeah, you weren't prepared for this. Yeah. Okay, well, this was a last-minute thing. I could, I could understand what that would happen. Uh, so, so um, did you go to Beale Street as well? Yes, I did, actually, with Valerie, yeah. Oh, so you saw all the same stuff she basically talked about? Yes. These sort of guys jumping over yes. and all that stuff. Ah, very, very cool. So do you, uh, when you perform... And you do Elvis, do you feel like his presence all around you, or is it just a natural thing that comes out of you? It feels like, it feels like, I feel like Priscilla's watching, mm -hmm. while I do an impersonation after her husband, mm -hmm. so Priscilla. And uh, yeah, it's very sad about her, her, his daughter, you know, Lisa Marie Presley, which was a person that I knew personally myself. But um, that's very sad. Uh, but then, um, when you go to Graceland, will you think you they were going to allow you on the second floor because nobody's ever been up there? No. Probably not. I figured that, but uh, even, even other impersonators have visited Graceland and are never really allowed to visit the second floor because that's the rule that they have, that Elvis never wanted anybody in his private room. Yeah. But, you know... Who knows? Maybe that'll change once they see you. Yeah. You never know, right? I mean, they might see you do Hound Dog or something like that. Well, when you do your shows, what's the opening song that you use? I use Also Sprout Zorada, aka the Rocket theme. Mm -hmm. And then I do. The same thing like Elvis that. Da -da, da -da, da -da. Yes, same thing. But right. basically, I do That's All Right. That's all, that's all Right. That's All Right, Mama? Yeah. 
Well, that's one of the early Sun Session studios. Now, while you guys were here, I forgot to actually ask Valerie Searcher this question. Did you guys visit Sun Studios? Where yes, we did. Elvis and all those guys recorded their first yes, records? Yes, we did. And actually, as you guys can see right there, we are, um, there, as, there is a photo of me with the microphone that Elvis actually used. Oh, wow. So, Imagine that. I mean, the microphone that was used over how many years? 1954. So 50 years, probably. Jesus. And this microphone is still in existence. It still looks good. It's, uh, it's in the Sun Studios. For those of you who haven't been there, I suggest you take a visit to Graceland and, and the Sun Studios and take a ride to Memphis. You, you won't be disappointed. Everybody who comes there seems to have a wonderful time. So are you performing anywhere tonight? Uh... Well, everybody knows that on the side of Maze Ham or WrestleMania, obviously, and uh, we're actually, I'm actually having a match tonight, which Valerie Search is supposed to be in my corner, so that's... Oh, so we a wrestling match? Yes. So besides uh, being an Elvis impersonator, you're also a wrestler? Yes, I am. Oh, well, this is a whole new story altogether here, folks. Let's hear about some of this. Have you ever wrestled with Hulk Hogan? No, actually. How about Raul Mata? Who? Raul Mata. Mexican Never. wrestler. Pedro Morales? Nope. Um, I haven't versed with any of the important guys. I versed. Oh, you're just uh, like a basically um, an independent wrestler. Yes. An independent wrestler. You do um, the shows with like uh, up and coming people. Yes. So you haven't hit the big time yet with that. Yes. All right, that's understandable. There's nothing wrong with that. Everybody's got to start off somewhere, right, folks? Yeah. It's a, it's a, where there's a will, there's a way. And when you have the way, there is no way that anyone could get in your way. You know what I'm saying? Let's get back to the interview. So, um, okay, so tonight after wrestling, do you do a performance or are you going to take the night off and perform tomorrow night? Probably perform tomorrow night. So and uh, Daddy O is telling me that's if you guys know who Daddy O is, you know who he is. Daddy O tells me he's going to take it seriously tonight. So I was. Okay. All right, well, we'll have to take another commercial break. This uh, next break is uh, Wonder Bread, uh, your favorite kind of bread that everybody in America loves, and you always can eat it with peanut butter and jelly and a nice spread of cream cheese. We'll be back right after this. Okay, thank you, folks, for watching the show tonight. We were very happy to have AJ and Valerie on the show, but as of now, the show is over, and I really got to go do pee-pee. So <laughs> No, you don't. No, I do, actually. Don't get that on me. <laughs> I told you. I am ill.